Kristen Armstrong's broken clavicle won't keep her out of the Olympics, she told me today. The only thing that could is the Olympic Selection Committee. Armstrong sounded a little like a college football analyst today, saying her body of work this spring should be enough to prove her worth to 2012 Team USA. 1984 gold medalist Connie Carpenter said she didn't envy the Selection Committee having to pick from three women for two spots. The fact that she's got this injury and that there's two months to go, I think anybody on the selection committee knows that she can come back from this. So if she would have come in here and just had a great race, it would have been really easy just to go to the next step, which is the final prep for London. But um, she's going to make the team. I think they know how I can race. I've um, gone out there and shown it all spring. They've seen consistency from me, so I'm not worried about that. As for today's race, a wild crash with only a thousand meters to go took out the defending World Cup champion, but everyone was okay, no broken bones. At the finish line, a sprint won by Teresa Cliff Ryan, that is Armstrong's teammate who celebrated with her team and was joined by Armstrong for a surprise boost to everyone's spirits. There you go, Kristen. To come out here today and ride as a team, get in, get in the moves. We had a few girls in the moves, and then to win the stage, it's, it's an amazing feeling. And to see her at the end of the race, I wasn't expecting that. And so uh, it was definitely, I just wanted to get run up and give her a big hug, but I knew I had to be careful. <laughs> it was really exciting, and I, I could feel everyone's energy. German rider Ina Yoko Zutenberg is the overall leader. She was second today.